Hello and welcome back to Railroads Online. So today we are running a manifest cargo train out to the oil field and today we are joined by a couple of the fellas. Say hi fellas. Hi. Hello. All right. Hi. So special occasion today is Zach's birthday. Happy birthday Zach. Hey. All right. So we're on Zach's world today, and we will be running one of his trains to one of his locations. So hope you all enjoy the video, and let's go for it, fellas. Sweet. So, so, so wants to... what's nice. my job? <laughs> I need. Sorry. Job. <laughs> I'm gonna play nap time in the in the boxcar. That's gonna be my job. <laughs> I like, Isn't it always not? Isn't I, it always? I like nap time. Oh, if I'm looking at it, you can't have it. Ha <laughs> That's how it works. <laughs> yep. If you didn't know that, now you do. Oh, yeah. C N P R. Any chance I know what that means? Hmm. What is oh, yeah. it? California oh. and Pacific. Yes. Railroad. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> I remember. Like, I don't remember. Zach has joined the world of the ancient today. Isn't that good? <laughs> yes. <laughs> California and Pacific. You feeling old yet? A little bit. Uh, Not really. But uh, maybe in a couple days I'll feel it. <laughs> <laughs> Not until tomorrow morning. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Three, four hours to kick in. <laughs> That's right. All right. So we have a class 70 here today. Number 72. We're all fired up and ready. Just topped off the fire, turned on the headlight. Nice, nice. Side lamps, Fullerton. Very cool. Kind of dig that. Uh, give them credit for the naming process on these. Like that. A method to the madness. Something yes. we can all use. Going for a fairly hefty train here today. Nice. Yeah, we're gonna class seventy at Runport's money. I'm guessing it's pretty flat from here, so we should be pretty good to go. Most things yeah. are pretty flat out here, unless you did something totally crazy, <laughs> which happens. Box cars, some of the best loads in the game, right there. Take forever though. They do. They do. Yes. I would not be sad if that thing loaded two boxes at a time. Yeah, no. And I'm the one loading it. <laughs> yeah, it would make me sad. I'd be a happier human, I think. With a little bit of speed. But you would think they could tie a few boxes together, huh? And swing them eh. on the crane in one? Or is this just a wimpy crane? <laughs> because... <laughs> yeah, I don't know how heavy that little toolboxes but it looks like this is the same crane that flings logs around so you would think a couple of these could go at once but yeah. and look at those steel pipes <laughs> yeah yeah exactly right I mean, you gotta think one of those a little heavier than one of these I don't know could totally be crazy how much well, do they weigh if we actually look if I can get the load highlighted any chance that anybody can get the load highlighted and see what one of them adds there we go. All right. So we're at 2,866 pounds. This this is for science. 20, 200 pounds. 200 pounds of crate. So, yeah, they could... We could move four of these boxes at a time for what we're moving one log. Wow. That's, that's... Like, you got to think. I don't know how much a log weighs, I guess, but it's got to be more than 800 pounds. Those cars are heavy. So, that seems reasonable. But that's just guessing. Yep, so we need banded together crates. That's what we need. We need an upgrade. Yes. Um, would you like more in here? Or should we go for the next one? Is that a half, half, a, car? Now? half a car, half a car. Who's up in the car? Logo. Yep. One forward, good sir. Seventy-four is clear ahead. Did you? Well, don't forget the one up front then, because that one is empty now. 
Oh, you can go forward or backwards, either one. You can't go wrong in this situation, so if you want to go backwards or forward, either one. <laughs> uh -oh. Too many choices. <laughs> Do I have a handbrake on someplace? I don't seem to cost very well. The guy in the local oh. might have had too much to, uh, you know. <laughs> Christmas dinner. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, I'm not sure. Handbrake should all be off, last I checked. You're going to have to give it some gas. I'm it's double definitely. Sure. Yeah, fair enough. It's a heavy train. Yes, definitely. You I mean, broke bro it. No, I'm just kidding. The fully loaded... Uh, there uh, we go. You good. Tubes are 35,000 pounds, so that's quite a lot. Yeah. Yeah, the pipes are, are heavy. Yeah. Perfect. We're in, the, we're in there. How come we're sliding backwards? What are we doing? Oh. I don't know That's, if it's going to work now. It's the it's that glitch that happens. Rev that forward. baby forward, Kermit. It's working. It's working. There we go. Perfect. Nope. Take off the brake, Kermit, and then uh, let's see if we can get it to... There we go. We're going to have to put on the tender brake. I put on one boxcar brake, too, so... It's... That will be up to hold the train. Yeah, it should hold now. Yeah, something interesting that happened. Yeah, a little bit of driftage. <laughs> Even, it's only when the engine brake is on. It's like the power is slightly applied. And it goes either forward or back, depending on the engine. Huh. Yeah. That's funny. Yeah, I know. So, we, uh, we noticed some other bugs today, too. There's that whole, like, uh, if you re-rail a loaded car, seems to be kicking clients out of the game. Crash. Not kicking out. Uh, crash is a better word. So that that's definitely a thing. As of right now. So hopefully that uh, that gets looked at because that's somewhat sketchy. Yes, and it's kind of troublesome when you load cars and then someone accidentally falls behind. They come back to the train and crash, and then right. you have to reset for just to fix it. Right. Yeah. But, it's yeah. it's kind of weird. At least it's, it's I don't think it's doing it without re-railing though. So at least that's yes. Good it's, as yeah. long as you keep them on the rail. But yep. Not so great if you don't really understand what's going on. That's for sure. Mm -hmm. I yeah. myself help. Never mind. <laughs> Well, that's one where we kind of get an advantage being, you know, we have 250 people pointing out comments in the Discord all the time about what crashes and bugs people have found along the way, so it's kind of kind of nice to get some shared information, I guess. Or I wouldn't have had any idea that that was happening. So that one's a credit to you guys. Yeah. And then trying to sort out how these different crashes interlock with each other. Hmm. It makes it fun, though. I mean, let's be honest. Sometimes chasing down some of these bugs is pretty fun, so... I could see being bored without them. I don't know. The day things are running perfect, we'll have to see. <laughs> yeah, it could be... Don't say it too early, Art. Uh, yeah, we might all be like, Hey! Put something back. We want to find it. <laughs> I don't know. Early it's access. Up. Yeah. Early access, indeed. If there weren't any bugs or features, then it might be kind of boring. That's <laughs> I love the use of the word features. Hidden surprising features. They're, <laughs> they're fun. Yeah, you know, as long as you don't take it too seriously, they, they are anyway, right? Right. Fifteen. One more to go. I like the half loads. It's good. I like that. I do it. It's pretty cool. Keeps them more in demand. I hate it when you fill them up and you got nothing else to do. This right. one is full. Can we get the other one, please? Full enough. Are we even going to fill the other one? I don't think he needs that many. I no? think we're good to go. No, I think we're, we're good to go. Yeah. We're... Oh, okay. Sorry. All right. Boxcar. Hey, man. Can't go wrong with filling everything. Boxcar brake is off. 
What's Are up? we doing a rolling un unload or a stopping unload? Uh, we got a lot of mixed stuff, so we'll probably have to do some control loading because it's not all going to line up at the dock just on a stop and roll. Plus, the box cars are pretty hard to do on the roll. All right, so, so stop in the... Yeah, whatever you line up. You got wood up front, box cars in the middle, and steel in the back, so... However they line up. Good news is we can put somebody on all the docks, so we can definitely get stuff unloaded. Yes. we got enough people. It's an army. Brake. Let's turn this brake off. Also, someone want to get that boxcar brake that was set. I did. Off. Awesome. You're good to go. All right. Highball. No, no brake on the caboose. I'm warming up the caboose because it's cold. It's winter time. <laughs> uh oh. What's going on? You alright back there? <laughs> no, the doors won't. This door. Why, why is that door closing? Open. Fire! Oh, have you forgotten your key? Yay! <laughs> no, it was just. I don't know. I was doing some weird stuff. You know. Oop. That's your window. I'll take this window. This is somewhere I do not ever get to be very often. <laughs> nice. It's warm in here. I have a seat, and I have a window, which means I am not, oh, look at that, I can't see the front of the train. All right, sorry, I have to go play with the render distance. I mean, you could get into the uh, box car up here, then you can see the full train. Yeah, that's yeah. how I'm going to poke along. This is kind of a different, interesting one for me, because I don't see the world from the other side very often as I host more often than uh, client side so I don't, I don't uh, see and I sure don't record from this aspect very often so it's kind of interesting to see the render difference yeah middle of the train does it you see the whole thing from in here awesome yeah I, I'm seeing it all but yeah I'm glad you finally got a spot you can see the whole thing yeah, the host can see for long... Host can see for almost double what a client can see. In fact, I'm pretty sure it is twice as much. Oh, is she creaking and cracking? Oh. Oh. You have hydraulics on the Tinder. Nice. No, I'm just kidding. Uh -oh. <laughs> is it, is it popping? Just a little bit of lowrider action, but it's okay. You know... That's cool. You know, options, man. Options. <laughs> Thanks for a ride. Yep. Lord. All right. Floor it. We don't really have that far to go, probably, to floor it. Yeah, Let the class you... 70 roar. <laughs> We're actually at 100 on the regulator. Really? Well, there, there you go. That's a big train. Check out the gangster stroll on this dude. We are really narrow gauging it up now. I'm going to start calling this guy the gunslinger instead of Johnny <laughs> Railroad because this walk, I'm telling you, if that's not Clint Eastwood, I don't know what is. And that's the I mean it walk. Yeah, man. <laughs> This is, I have a Derringer in each pocket. Oh, God. That's what's going on. <laughs> we run around too much to see how serious this dude is. He ain't playing. <laughs> you know. <laughs> he doesn't play around. He's like, you got a ticket? No ticket? Oh. <laughs> you know what we really need? We need a kick movement so he can kick people off the train. That's what we need. <laughs> we need a boot to the butt button. That'd be funny. All right. Guess we'll unload tools first, and then back up and get some beans, and then finish off with the pipes. I'm sorry. Did you say beans? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> is that? Is that because I like magic beans? 
<laughs> yeah, once we drop off, so, oh, whoa. Ooh, coming in pretty a little, hot there. A little bit of a, a little bit of a hello there when you hit the uh, break. What, what do we want to unload first? Beams. Oh, I guess we can unload beams and then back up for right. a box car. This is lumber. This ain't beams, bro. Oh, ah, I was mistaken. Uh oh. I thought we. Oh, no. Cool. Well, I got some. Change so of plans. Way. No. <laughs> 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 Oh no! Yo, know, it's cool. Is unloading these box cars? No. <laughs> <laughs> hey, at least we already got some here. That's so we'll build... fine. We stopping. We stopping. Uh, you could you could uh, get them both on here. Move a little forward, just a little bit. Oh no, Kappa, no stop -a. Hey, you could drift. Nothing's gonna hurt you. The slow roll forward. Creepage. Not sure what they call it. We only have room for four, what, six more. Six more box car. Or box drop. Two more. Full. Oh, full. I was burning some of these pipes. Woo! I wonder how many of these pipes we're going to be able to burn. With 12 beams. This lumber is going to have to no, find a please. different oh. home. Yes, please. it is. They didn't all unload, please. What? Nope, they won't. Or was it not the plan? You can't, because it's full. Oh, I it's full, so open my eyes. Yeah, they won't drop, and then it's he's got lumber on the front, so we're not going to be able to do the beams, so we're just going to have to unload as much steel as we can. It's going to have to be the plan. We make adjustments on the fly. It's okay. Oh, yes. Yeah. Box car, Bob. All right, go ahead and start slowing it down. Poof. All give right. Gimme, 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 gimme. Gimme the bug, gimme the bug. Nice. Keep rolling, rolling. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Geronimo, taking in the sights, man. What's up? See, I mean, when this guy comes walking up to you on the dock, and he's like, "Hey, what are you doing? You know you're <laughs> in trouble, man. You're not supposed to be there." A little forward. Yes, please. <laughs> Run it. There we go. Hold on. Nope. Yep. One more car. One more car. One more car. Ooh. You should blow some crazy train whistles just for fun. Oh, yeah. Hang on. Uh, look nope. at this. Uh, uh. I like it when people do this. Uh, uh. Or you can just go around to the back. Walk right in there. <laughs> Whoa. Up, 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 up. Uh-oh. We gotta unload. How many more can we fit in here? It's a never-ending stream of pipe. There we go. Oh. That was a nice crossing there. Boy, you're actually getting full on on a uh, crude oil pretty soon there, man. Looking good, sir. Thank you. That's some effort filling that one. Is that the Derrick's making noise or your locomotive? <laughs> that might be the Derek. So the locomotive's far away to make noise. That'd be funny. Choo -choo, choo -choo, choo -choo. If the locos chug that hard. One car forward, please, sir. And yeah, yeah more car load will do it. Uh, yeah. Actually, you only got six. I don't think you can even drop. 
Maybe you get a nine on there. You can fill it. Yeah, I think I'll fill it, and then uh, she we'll be good. gonna attack them all. Yeah, then we'll have to just peel off those lumber cars and replace them with four beam cars or something. At least they're on the yeah. front of the train, so you could just peel them off. Yeah, take them really. somewhere else. It's not gonna mess you up too much, and then come back and just shove them back to the rest of this stuff. That's not so bad. Well, there we yeah, go. We are full on awesome. pipes. So we're full on pipes. We're full on tools. And sorry to say on this one, we're probably not going to fill it with lumber, but uh, we'll work on that in some spare time. But again, happy birthday to Zach. Awesome. Thank you. Awesome. Birthday, man. Big party. And thanks for hosting us. Yes, for of course. Sure. Awesome. With that, I think we'll call that one a win. Say thanks for tuning in. Remember, if you get a chance, like, share, subscribe. Subscriptions are free, but they sure do help the channel. Y'all have a great day.